My name is David Bowden. Yeah. And uh, I'd like to start some things off for you guys. Um, you know, a lot of people tell us that we cannot change our world, that it's too big of a problem, but they're looking at it the wrong way. The thing is, if everyone in the developed country would work with one person in the developing country, we could end poverty one for one. And that's a movement started by Tom Shoes, that one for one idea that every pair you buy goes to a child in need. And so I wrote a poem that conveys that one for one idea that I'd like to share with you now. Walk. The command to every legged, landlot, naked, sand clotted man, woman, and child on which manufactured, laced, and leathered feet protectors never smiled. Walk the mocking talk of daily stocks over rocks and hills, sharp on heels that would be healed if we would only yield our stock of shoe crop, overfilling, overspilling closets. Hey, it's Angie with News OK. I'm standing in the Bass Pro parking lot way, where the water walk for the Creativity World Forum is about to happen. I'm here with Blake, who is the founder of Tom Shoes. Now tell us what you guys are doing today. Well, uh, today we're doing a bunch of things actually. We're starting with a water walk to raise awareness for the millions of people that don't have access to clean drinking water all over the world. Kind of get everyone thinking about uh, that before the Creativity Forum today. And then I'll be speaking at around, uh, I think at around 11.30. Uh, I'm really just telling the story of Tom's shoes and encouraging people uh, to think about using creativity to solve world problems. So Tom's is, uh, has a very simple model. For every pair of shoes we sell, uh, we give a new pair of shoes to a child in need, always one for one. Um, and uh, yeah, sometimes uh, you know, simplicity is, uh, is a great form of creativity. And we keep it very simple. There's no formulas, no percentages. Uh, you just buy a pair of our shoes and we give a pair away. And we've given over a million pairs of shoes away now. Well, what we're doing today is uh, the same thing that millions of people around the globe do every day. And that's we're walking to carry water. Um, the average person in uh, sub-Saharan Africa who's impoverished walks four to five hours a day to collect water that's all too often uh, unclean and even deadly. That being said, it takes one dollar to give somebody clean water for an entire year. So today we're here to tell their story and hope that people respond and change things. Um, we filled up our water over by Bass Pro Shop and we brought it over here and we're going to walk to the Cox Convention Center. It means a lot to me. I like to experience stuff like this and to help make a difference. It's really important. Absolutely. I mean, I think that's what you see a lot of the kids here. I don't have shoes on and that's to, you know, to see what it feels like. Uh, it's pretty chilly today, so uh, I think I'm going to have to take my shoes off in a second. And, uh, but it's, it's good. It's, you know, it, it doesn't hurt to kind of feel a little discomfort to you know, kind of bring that awareness really close to home. If we're going to solve the world's biggest problem, I think the best way to do that is to use the creativity that we have. And so if we can put on, you know, put on something symbolic that represents what they do, that changes hearts, that's what it's all about. Walk is not an option when your feet are your mobility, the ability to fetch water, go to school, and work for yours and you. Walk speaks too often to those who can't offset its awful weight with some rubber string and cloth set underneath its feet. So we walk for something different. We walk for something new. We walk to give assistance. We walk in two sets of shoes. One makes a statement, the other makes a rescue. This one's worn by me, the other is sent to prove that you only need one pair of feet to do the work of two. So now we invite you to walk as we do. Start where we've begun. Walk with more than two shoes. Tom's one for one.